In the last lesson I did on mass, I was using the cycle button to show you what envelopes looked like. Technically, a cycling envelope would be considered an LFO, which we'll cover in a later episode. So I'm going to redo that, and I'm going to show you sending gates from a sequencer into the trigger input of mass and opening a VCA. So in this first patch here, I have my sequencer sending out gates and CV. So it's sent out simultaneously, so every time CV is sent to my oscillator to control the pitch, there's a gate that's sent out. This gate now is going to go into the trigger and put on mass here, and that's going to activate the envelope. I'm going to come out of the unattenuated output on mass, and that's going to be seen on the top on my oscilloscope there, and that's opening up my VCA over here. So then I have, I'm using channel one here, so I have the unattenuated output, and then output one over here is being controlled with an attenuverter. So it's the same output as one, it's just that you're able to control the voltage level with this knob here. As you can see on the, tra on the uh, data there. And what's that? That's modulating the uh, filter I have off screen. So, I'm going to mess around with this envelope. Pretty cool, right? So in this patch here, it's pretty similar to the first one. The only difference is now, on channel four here, I'm using the unattenuated output here to affect the rise of the envelope I'm sending to my VCA. Let's just have a listen. And also, keep, just take a look at the oscilloscope there. Look how the envelope changes. Just using the cycle button here. And it's basically acting as an LFO. Alright, we're going to do a little jam session here. Thanks for watching.